It's the prize jewel of the Studebaker Museum, but the Lincoln carriage that took President Lincoln to Ford's Theater on the night of his assassination will be moving to the Smithsonian, but only temporarily as part of an exhibit marking the 150th anniversary of Lincoln's death. WSBT 22's Patrick Roth joins us at the Update Center, and Patrick, moving this carriage has to be a lot of work. That's right, Jennifer. It's one of the state, the museum's oldest and most treasured pieces, and they're taking every precaution to make sure that they can safely move this carriage almost halfway across the country. On April 14, 1865, when President Abraham Lincoln and his wife Mary Todd made that faithful trip to Ford's Theater, they rode in this carriage. And now, almost 150 years after Lincoln's assassination, the carriage is leaving its longtime home at the Studebaker Museum and returning to Washington, D.C. Uh, the Studebaker Nash Museum is uh, loaning the Lincoln carriage, uh, the carriage President Lincoln took to Ford's Theater the night he was assassinated, uh, to the Smithsonian Institution for uh, their exhibit commemorating the 150th anniversary of Lincoln's assassination. Absolutely. We're very honored to be a part of this national commemoration exhibit that's taking place in Washington, D.C. And uh, any time the Smithsonian's involved, it's a uh, great honor. To make sure the carriage arrives safe and sound in Washington, the museum hired two firms that specialize in moving carriages and antiques, and it's an elaborate process. Uh, rather than lashing the carriage down in a trailer or something like that, we're actually building a crate, uh, a full enclosure that the carriage itself will ride in. So essentially we're moving you know, the crate, uh, the container and the carriage as one unit. Before they build the crate around the carriage, they need to line it with special padding. It's museum grade felt like material that will protect the carriage and applying it can take hours. They arrived this morning at about 9 o'clock and were slated to work all throughout the day here and tomorrow. And uh, we've got a full day ahead of us here and uh, also going to be finishing up tomorrow and then it uh, heads on the truck out to the Smithsonian where we, we unpack it and then we just do the reverse uh, at the end of May. The carriage will return to South Bend at the start of June, but on June 19th, the museum will open up its own exhibit commemorating the 150th anniversary of Lincoln's death and they'll be bringing in a lot of pieces from museums all across the country. In the studio, Patrick Roth, WSBT 22 News.